Welcome to the SAP Business One Academy Helpful How-Tos. Helpful How-Tos are quick sessions showing you how to perform some of the most common tasks in SAP Business One. A lot of these helpful how-tos are based on questions that have come in from users of the SAP Business One Academy. So don't forget, if you'd like to have a helpful how-to recorded specially for you, please send your questions to admin at sapbusinessoneacademy.com and we'll get it into the queue. So without any further ado, this helpful how-to is going to show you how to quickly reallocate a license from one user to another. So in SAP Business One, you'll know that every user is required to have a license. And there are a couple of different license types, not going to go into the details of that, but the licensing model is on the basis of named users. So I've got a user who's called Bob and Bob has just left the company and he's been replaced by a user called Carlos. So what do I need to do? Well, I don't want to delete Bob, but I do want to take his license and reallocate it to Carlos. So how do I do that? Well, it's pretty simple. I go into SAP Business One, and by the way, if you're an SAP Business One user and you're looking at this user interface and thinking, gee, what's that? I'm actually recording this in version nine of SAP Business One, which is currently in ramp up. And this is what we call our golden thread user interface. So I go into administration. I go down here to license. Now, of course, all Business One functionality, you have to have the rights to do it. I'm logged in as the manager, so of course I can do this. But I go into license, then I go to license administration. So I find my first uh, user, and here's Bob. So currently, he's been uh, allocated a professional user license, a license to use the SAP add-ons. He's a mobile user, so he has a B1i license, and he's also got access to the SDK tools. So first step, is I want to take those licenses off Bob. So I untick those and then I'll choose update. Then I go across to Carlos, who's my new user, and I'm gonna allocate those licenses to him. So I simply tick the boxes and then I say update and then I say okay. And that's it, my licenses are now allocated to Carlos. Now one quick thing that you might wanna do is you might also want to go and double check that Carlos has the right authorizations. So again, we go up into system initialization and authorizations. Then we go into general authorizations and you'll select Carlos and you'll see, does he have the right authorizations? I'm going to cover uh, some hints and tips on authorizations in another one of our helpful how to's, but that brings this one to a close. Uh, hopefully you've found it useful. And again, any feedback you've got, don't forget to email admin at sapbusinessoneacademy.com or, of course, get onto our forums and leave a message. Thanks.